Manchester United have three contract priorities after Bruno Fernandes pens new deal. One down, three to follow? Bruno Fernandes has signed a new contract with Manchester United committing himself to the club until June 2026, at the very earliest. And the Red Devils can now turn their attentions towards other matters instead. United announced on Friday morning that Fernandes had penned a new deal, saying in a statement, Manchester United is delighted to announce that Bruno Fernandes has signed a new contract, which will keep him at the club until June 2026, with the option to extend for a further year. The Portugal international has contributed 49 goals and 39 assists in just 117 games for United. Fernandes, who has already won the Sir Matt Busby Player of the Year award twice, has created more chances than any other United player since joining the club in January 2020. And with Fernandes's long-term future now resolved, the Red Devils can focus on other matters instead. Paul Pogba, Jesse Lingard and Edinson Cavani aren't priorities, with the club already resigned to losing the trio on free transfers at the end of the campaign. Instead, it's Marcus Rashford, Luke Shaw and David De Gea who are pressing matters for the likes of John Murto and Richard Arnold behind the scenes. Both Shaw and Rashford's current deals run until 2023, though the club do have the option to renew both of their respective contracts by a further year. Think you know sport? Test your sporting knowledge with our tricky quiz, and while they've been off the boil this term, there's a sense the club would benefit from having them around. Take Shaw, by example. This season he's often struggled for consistency, leading for him to sometimes be dropped in favor of former Porto star Alex Tells. Yet Shaw, on his day, can be one of the best left-backs in world football, never mind just the Premier League. Last season, under Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, the former Southampton star was a threat and a menace on the left side of their defense, finally coming good. And that saw him become Gareth Southgate's number one pick for England at the European Championships, with Shaw shining and forcing his way into the team for the final. United, it recently emerged, are hopeful of keeping the 26-year-old. Don't miss Ronaldo has hinted at what he wants as Man United I Ten Hag Anthony comments suggest Ten Hag reunion at Man United is possible Man United's best eye for next season, if Ten Hag signs three players, but they may have to keep the England international happy, especially after he recently suggested he wasn't entirely wanted at Old Trafford. Likewise, Rashford. It's been a troublesome season for the forward, who has scored just five goals across all competitions. Rashford isn't the player he was when he first burst onto the scene under Louis van Gaal, where he netted eight times from 18 games in the 2015-2016 season. But if United can get Rashford fully firing, there's no denying he's a player worth keeping. They'll be hopeful he doesn't leave and go elsewhere, with clubs like Arsenal, Barcelona, and Paris Saint-Germain all linked at the current moment in time. Because if Rashford does finally fulfill his potential, he's got the ability to become a mainstay in the side for the next decade. Want the latest football news? Join our brand new Facebook group by clicking here a third contract priority for United would be keeping David de G2. Sure, there's no denying his distribution often leaves much to be desired, especially when compared with Deputy Dean Henderson. However, de G has been back to his best this term after previously struggling during Solskjaer's reign. His deal is due to run out in 2024, but his displays this term show he deserves fresh terms, with the player now back to being an integral part of the side. Whether United hurry up new deals for Rashford, Shaw and Aji in the wake of their decision to tie Fernandes down remains to be seen. Yet they're a trio who can be vital in the future and Murto would do well to accelerate extensions as the club plan for brighter, better days ahead. Fernandes himself, meanwhile, has admitted he's delighted at committing to the Red Devils for the next four years. From the moment that I joined Manchester United, I have had a special relationship with the club and our amazing fans, he said. I grew up watching this team, dreaming of getting the chance to play here one day. That dream is now a reality and an honor. Even after two years, it still feels amazing to step out at Old Trafford, to hear the fans sing my song, and to score in front of the Stretford end. It is a true privilege to wear this shirt and to fight for our incredible club. There is so much more that I want to achieve here, and I know that is the same for the rest of the squad and staff. More than anything, we want to give the fans the success that they deserve. We have shared some great moments over the last years, but the best is yet to come from myself and this team.